Check this out, Eric. Wow, this is a M60 A3 battle tank. It was used back in 1960 to 1987. Let's walk to the front of it, or actually let's walk around it real quick. Look at those big wheels here. It's pretty cool. Look at those wheels. Wow. He would sit in that cabin sweating bricks, didn't know where the enemy was coming from. You want you have a guy manning the gun and one manning the drivetrain. Pretty cool. Today we travel to Green, New York. Uh, Green, New York is located in Chenango County. Um, and as of the uh, 2010 census, the population here in Green is approximately 5,604. Again, that dates, it's a little outdated. The town itself is named after General Nathaniel Green and it's located um, southwest corner of the county and there's also a village that we're going to do a walkthrough of also called green so the town and the village are both called green g-r-e-e-n-e -E -E. uh, the town and the village are northeast of binghamton and um, green was founded in 1792 so we're gonna just park this little beast and me and Eric are gonna go take a little walk. And our, we parked on Manel Street and it's been, actually let's take a look at that bridge real quick. Approaching Chenango River. So we're checking out this bridge that goes over the Chenango River. Uh, it looks like there's some clouds rolling in. And across the street, there's a park called Bull Flats Park. The town was originally known as Hornby, but the name was changed to Green to honor General Nathaniel Green, who was a hero in the American Revolution. So let's check out the Chenango River real quick. Then we'll head down up the heart of the village and look at that big beautiful victorian home on the banks of the river it's got to be at least a nine bedroom house it's probably over a hundred years old and you can see the chair the lawn chair just sitting out there look at that porch the rocker um, overlooking the chenango river i can definitely uh, see myself waking up with a cup of joe looking at this beautiful picturesque view uh, there's a historic sign here which reads uh, first bridge across the chenango river wow was built in on this site in 1807 susquehanna and bath turnpike crossed here okay so the village is behind us so we're gonna make a quick u-turn and head back but yeah right so we crossed we're gonna head back toward the village And at the entrance to this village, we will find the Civil War Memorial. Um, and according to Wikipedia, about two dozen men from Green enlisted during the Civil War. And there's another picturesque view of the Chenango River. And 
and here's the entrance to the Bull Flats Park. We might check it out later. So, according to niche.com, let me fix the camera real quick. According to niche.com, niche gives green New York an overall grade of B plus. They get B for public schools, B plus for housing, B plus good for families, crime and safety gets an A, nightlife gets a B plus, diversity gets a B minus. Look at this interesting little house. Some cool decor. And uh, again, according to niche.com, uh, the median home value here in green is approximately 149,000. Uh, median rent here is 689. We're gonna check out the memorial real quick. And it's a very walkable little village actually. It's fairly small and there's a memorial here in honor of World War veterans, 1917 to 1919. There's a name of uh, those who died and gave the ultimate sacrifice for our freedoms. Take a look at the memorial real quick. In memory of our heroes who served in the defense of the Union. Love it. All right, let's get back onto the main strip and take a little walk. It's a beautiful day, but I'm a little scared of what's coming up our way over the horizon. You can see how light the sky is, is on this side. Hold on, slow down. Let's see what this guy's doing. Okay, he's letting us pass. Letting us pass, Eric. And then me and Eric are gonna get some ice cream and some pizza. We're gonna have a little fun, maybe find a playground. Are you okay, bud? Oh man, well, you're, you're okay. You scratched yourself, bud? No, the little, the little rock thing scratched you? Yeah. Uh -huh. Oh, you're, you're okay. It's not It's not that bad. It's really hot. Should we go to the emergency room? Oh, just okay, you'll be fine. You'll be fine. What should we do? Show me your finger. Oh, that's a big boo-boo you got there. We might have to amputate it. Really? I'm kidding, I'm kidding. A lot of traffic in downtown Green. It's a beautiful day. Uh, this here, let's just check this out. See that church I wanna look at. We are uh, on Genesee and What's that say? Genesee and... Okay, so this is Genesee and Chenang Chenango Street. Let's just check out that church over here. It's not that far off. Then we'll come back to the main strip. Next to Magro's Pizzeria. Magro's Pizzeria. It smells delicious. Eric, this pizza place smells delicious. You might have to grab a few slices. How you doing? Hey, man. Beautiful day. Yes, it is. Walk town? Oh, yeah. Enjoy. Thank you. And uh, according to niche.com, the median household income 
is approximately fifth, just uh, over $63,000 per year. But there's some beautiful residential homes up ahead. I don't want to go too far down the residential block because we haven't seen the main strip yet. So I did want to uh, veer off the main strip just to take a look at this cool church. So let's cross the street and take a quick peek. This is, this is where the folks of Green come to celebrate their weddings and all the big holidays. Easter and Christmas, right, Eric? So, very imposing looking church. It's the Zion Episcopal Church. There we go. And I'm sure it's beautiful inside. All right, let's go back to the downtown area. You see these Victorian homes all around. Look at the Easter eggs, Eric. No, I don't think you should open them, bud. Are you allowed to? I don't think you should. But are you allowed to? I'm sure you're allowed to, I'm sure. But you don't. Uh, I don't think you're going to get in trouble. All right, back on the main drag on Genesee Street. Do a quick walkthrough of the village. Yeah, we're gonna go wash your hands in just a sec. Chiropractic business, yep. A law firm. Bonnie's Breakfast and Lunch, which is closed. Looks like a little diner. And we, we, here we have the little shop of guitars. Just gonna take a quick peek inside. Wow, very cool. Hey man, mind if we take a peek? Awesome. Wow. My fiance is learning to play. I don't have a musical bone in my body. Need listeners. Very cool. How long have you been around uh, in the green? Uh, I've been here for 16 years. Okay. And before that, I had a building on Route 12 for 18 years. Do you have a website? Nah, I have a Facebook page that I really don't do much with. I'm okay. And what's the name of the guitar store? Heroes Music. Thank you, man. I'm Phil. Roman, nice to meet you. Doing a little travel video of green with my oh, little, nice. my little man. So Who's your friend? that's my son, Eric. Eric. How's Eric. <laughs> oh, he he cut his finger. So need he, a band aid? If you have one, sure. Yeah. Too fancy. Not a virtual. Okay. okay. You know what I mean. So. Uh, <laughs> Mister. This is yeah, and Daddy got some pepperoni and some mushrooms. Enjoy, buddy. Check out Sherwood Inn. This place has been closed for many years.
scary. Yeah. Oh, flickers. Look at this cool painting over here. Oh, oh let's go check it out. Well, that oh, that's the tap room. Wow. Whoa. Hold on. Let's check out the tap room. Oh, look at this. Yeah, that's the basement that room. So and there's the tap this room. Reminds me of the, there's a TV that's being set up. This reminds me of those. Uh huh. Those scary. Very cool. Very cool. I'm very glad we were able to check this out. No, you can't go in there, Eric. That's scary. This stuff. The Sherwood Inn, guys. The Sherwood Hotel. And now it's kind of raining a little bit, so we can try to do this walkthrough without letting the rain ruin the video for us. The, the, like Eric is very excited. Why? Why are you excited? Because you got to go into a haunted hotel. Yeah, There's well, it a felt like doors. Copper Pigs haircuts. It felt like doors. And this is a spa, Focus Salon spa it looks like and what is this this is resale okay some nope the rain is coming back the rain is coming back eric uh-oh this is called comfort electric it's a little gift shop oh let's check it out Cool little gift shop here. Wow. They have some nice lamps. Very cool shop. 